Ta-da! Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, children of all ages, we are back again with another Louis Vuitton review. This is the four key holder. Very simple name, simplistic name, but it does a bunch of crap, at least for me. So here we go. I got this off of uh, LouisVuitton.com, which is my preferable way to order almost anything uh, from this particular brand because, yeah, no, it comes in a nice uh, package. It gave me a little bag. Well, I picked it up in the store, so that's why I have this bag. Otherwise, it would probably come in a weird box and then all this stuff was included. Now, the cool thing is, apparently, they gave me their new fragrance, fra fragrance, fragrances, fragrances, some orange, orange, and some other name that I probably can't pronounce, and mensite, le mensite, sounds pretty French, so there's those things, and it came in a nice cute little pouch, oh, kind of, I guess the names of them? Oh, whatever. So yeah, there's that. That was very nice of them to do. And of course, your customary receipt and all that junk like that. It says, hey, thank you for buying. Here's your receipt. I can show you the receipt. Why? Because, uh, you know, for clarification reasons. But that's basically what it looks like. So, ooh -hoo. Yeah, that's fine. And they gave you this little thing. I don't know what the, oh, no, this is, this is a little card saying, you know, if you, when you buy stuff online, you can give it a little custom card, which you can write something on. And if you don't write anything, I don't think it'll give you anything. Let's see what it says. I don't know if I wrote anything. But look how cute the envelope is. So you can always re-gift this somehow, put something in there. Yeah, it's a blank ass card, because I wrote nothing for myself. You know what, I'm gonna start writing shit on this thing, because when I get a blank card. Oh, you know what I can do though? Dude, get it blank and then you can give it to somebody like write some little cute little message, maybe your girlfriend, your wife, your side piece, whatever you got, man. It'll work. All right, so we undo the bow. Very nice. The best box game in the business is from Louis Vuitton because it's always that draw case. The best. And the little dush. Oh, did they put money in there for me? Holy crap. Cause it sounds like it. God damn. Okay, here it is. Ta-da! All right. So this is the beautiful four key holder, and what does it say on their website for a description? Let's find out. It is okay. This compact key holder is a Domir graphite canvas, and it holds up to motherfucking four keys for individual. Wait. Four keys on individual brass hooks. I didn't know that. An elegant accessory to complement any bag from the collection. Wow, those those are nice guys to say that. So let's see what we got here. So it has a beautiful little zipper. It's black and great. Well, graphite, whatever. I'm doing. I'm getting it to replace this bad boy. As you can see, it's been a. I've had this. God. I don't know, seven, eight years? I have no idea, a long ass time. But it is getting old and frayed and also brown. And you know, I'm into like the new, whatever the hell this is called, Eclipse. But they don't have this in Eclipse for whatever dumb reason. So this is the next best thing. Does it actually match? Yeah, it's pretty close. Now the only uh, downfall I could have seen for this is that it is a little bit longer than the original one that I have. As you can see, it's about, I don't know, let's say three quarters of an inch to a full inch of extra longage, which is not that bad. But what are you going to do, right? So let's open it up and see what's inside. Okay. All right, so that's interesting. Give me this little thing. Open it up, and I guess this little uh, key holder thing. Now, the weird thing about the description, it says there's four individual brass hooks. 
Do you see four individual brass hooks in this thing? Uh, yeah, me neither, man. So I don't know what that's about. That's kind of interesting. I never really read the description. Oh, but this pivots. That's a nice touch right there. The other one that I have does not do this little pivot thing. So this seems like a pretty good overall uh, replacement. Now the hook is obviously a lot different. It's a lot bigger than the other one. I don't know if I do too much, but enough. God damn it. Looks like you blow bubbles with it. But this one, instead of uh, pushing up and kicking out, I think you just screw. Yes. Just a screw down thing. So, very, very easy to push back in. Or is it? Oh my god, actually it is not. It takes a little finessing. Just, just a little finessing, not too much. You can get it right to the right tension. Should be good to go. Everything else about it looks pretty sturdy. The, the chain seems like it should be fine. I'm hoping. You got a nice uh, engraving right here. I don't know if you can see that properly with the lighting, but it does say Louis Berton. So I guess that's a nice touch. Other than that, it's just basic, uh, basic standard affair. The zipper seems a little cooler. Not by much, but a little bit hardware so there's that and you get a little what is this rivet yeah okay that's for this stupid thing okay for the chain itself oh that's why it pivots because it's a rivet pivots for rivets rivets for pivots sounds pretty good at least to me all right so we're living the dream right here out here in these streets and the zipper goes all the way around Okay, and as you can see, the zipper goes not only just through here, but it comes all the way down here. For what reason? Easier access, baby. Let's see what we can put in here real fast. Hold on. One moment. Because what I normally put in these things is like credit cards and stuff like that. Or my tea pass or tap card, whatever you want to call it. The tea is in Boston, not in California. I keep forgetting. I still call it the tea any damn way. And it fits. Oh, it fits lovely. It's, yeah, you get a little extra room for whatever else. So if you have like, I don't know, if you're a girl, lipstick and stuff like that, little things like that. It says it's for keys, but I see nothing about keys for this thing. That's kind of strange, unless they're hidden. I'm feeling, I don't feel anything. Nope, 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 nope. The date code is right in there. Back here, see? Well, you probably can't see it, but trust me, it's there, believe me. And this one says, made in France as opposed to Spain. In other places that they usually have them. I don't know. They have them in a wide variety of different places. And just one Louis Vuitton Paris right here on the Damier. Which is fine. I like it right there. Seems like a good uh, spot. So you know like exactly where your card should fit. You can fold bills in here. Do whatever you want. Put in here. That's why I just put just a couple credit cards. Because I hate putting things in my goddamn pocket. Other than that, seems to work fine. Looks pretty. Hope you enjoyed this uh, quick review of it. Sure, why not? If you want to see more videos such as this, don't forget to sub motherfucking subscribe. Because that's how life is in these streets. Like the, hit the like button, smash the like button, smack it, mash it, rub it down, flip it, lick it, whatever you want to do. I don't care. Just do it if you can. I'd appreciate that. Thank you all very much. All right, my name is Emilio. Enjoy the rest of your day.